Welcome to the Paper Post tutorial on creating a text opportunity. To begin, click on the Create Opportunity tab at the top of your account. To the far left, click on Text and Photo Ops. We'll walk through the process step by step. A text and photo opportunity allows you to request bloggers, or as we call them posties, to add their original content along with your links and photos to their blog posts. The Opportunity Summary box shows your account balance. This tells you how much money you have to work with. Step 1, Opportunity Overview, is where you begin to enter information for your opportunity and your first chance at grabbing the postie's attention. Bloggers will see your opportunity's title in their available ops list, so you want to make sure yours is short but creative. For example, instead of Review My Digital Camera Site, try something like Awesome New Digital Camera. Next, the short description field is where you offer the posties an idea of what you'd like them to write about. Posing a question is best, such as, do you remember Polaroid cameras? Save all specific instructions for the full description field. In this section, you should detail the who, what, where, and why of your opportunity. Giving details, keywords, and talking points will help the blogger create a post that provides the best value for you. Provide a couple sentences as far as background to your site, but don't overload them or they'll have no reason to visit the site. A great way to request multiple requirements is to offer them as bullet points. Remember that posties enjoy opportunities where they can offer experience and creativity. Ask them to select a favorite product of your site, or tell their readers how the service you offer is helpful to them, or maybe discuss a recent vacation, something personal. Any of these can be done while incorporating your site. Next, select the opportunity's end date and the minimum number of words you'd like in each post. Below that is post type and tone. Requesting a review is just that, a review of your site, a current promotion or event, a product, etc. Select Buzz if you'd simply like to spread the word in the blogosphere about your site, increasing awareness through our network of bloggers. Finally, we highly encourage you to seek opinion posts from our posties. Better than any pre-selected focus group, our community of posties offers great benefits in giving true opinions regarding your site's product, event, user interface, etc. Next, select the right tone for your posts. If you've chosen an opinion type post, neutral is the best tone. For buzz or review, the tone is basically up to you, though we encourage neutral for the most authentic post from our bloggers. Last question, do you require tracking? If you select yes, the posties will include an invisible tracking link in each post, and you'll be able to see the total number of views the posts page has received in your account. If you select no, the posties will not include this link, and you will not be able to see the number of views in your account. In Step 2, Disclosure Settings, you have a great chance to include a disclosure badge along with a bubble ad, all providing more exposure for your brand. Select Yes in the beginning of Step 2 if you'd like posties to include a disclosure badge specific to your opportunity. Next, you'll be able to select what wording and link the posties are to use in the badge. You may even provide us with your logo. You'll see a preview of the disclosure badge once you have completed this section. Finally, in step two, you may also request the posties have their badges trigger a bubble ad, allowing for further exposure. This is like a personal pop-up that only appears when a visitor scrolls over your badge. In step three, targeting and pricing, you will list the maximum number of posts for this opportunity as well as your offer amount. Remember that the paper post marketplace charges an additional 35% on top of the offer for each post. So if you're running a small campaign of one or two posts for an opportunity, Paper Post Direct may be the best option. For more information, click on the advertiser link on the paperpost.com website. Step 3 also allows you to exclude certain free hosted domain sites, as well as request a minimum average tag, minimum Google PR, and maximum Alexa score. You can also choose to automatically bench bloggers who take this opportunity for 30 days, which means that if you launch another opportunity in the next 30 days, they will be unable to take it. Section 4, Linking. Remember that you don't have to require a link, though there is SEO benefit as well as driving traffic back to your site. You can choose either a direct link or a tracking link. Choosing a direct link adds value to your SEO, and choosing a tracking link allows you to view the clicks and views that your link has received. Next, enter your URL beginning with HTTP and in the following field, the anchor text that you would like for this link. The anchor text can be your company name, the name of your website, the product you're linking to, or the most common search term for this product or website. To the right of that, enter the number of posts you'd like for this link. The number that you're putting in this field and the original number in section three should be equal. Click on 
Add New Link if you'd like to supply additional links to internal pages or the same link with a different anchor text. If you're adding multiple links, the number and number of posts for each link should add up to the total that is in Step 3, Targeting and Pricing. Next is the Third Party Ad Tag field. If you have a third party or external company tracking your online ad campaigns and they've provided you with an ad tag, you can enter it here. You can also require images for the bloggers to put in their posts. This is in Section 5, Images. You may add up to three different photos and our posties will be required to include at least one of them in their post. The photos must be in a JPEG format and must be 800 by 600 pixels or smaller. The very last step is advertising your opportunity, step six. Here you can bold the title, highlight your opportunity, or place an advertisement that will appear in the blogger's dashboard. This will make your opportunity more prominent and appealing to the posties. Finally, hit the submit button. Your opportunity will then be reviewed by our staff to ensure it meets marketplace requirements. Opportunity reviews may take up to 24 hours and you will be notified of any rejections. Congratulations, you've submitted an opportunity for the Paper Post Marketplace. If you have any questions or issues, please click on the contact support link at the bottom of any page from within your Paper Post account. This will submit a ticket to us to get back to you.